This is going to be a short video on determining whether you have a positive or negative side on your speaker. Uh, you only need a couple things for this. Battery, speaker, wire leads coming off the speaker. Um, and later we're going to use a voltmeter to figure out which side is the positive and negative on the uh, terminals of the vehicle. Um, some speakers, uh, Kicker, any good brand, is going to be actually either labeled plus or minus or it's going to be red or black to show you whether it's positive or negative. If for some reason you have a off-brand speaker or it doesn't have the markings on it, in order to tell which way is which, if you take your battery, if you look on the battery, there's a positive and a negative marked on the battery. If you take one end of the wire, touch it to the positive, take the other end, touch it to the other side, the speaker is either going to push forward towards you or go down inward. If the speaker pushes outward towards you, you have the wires correct. So the positive is in the right spot, the negative is in the right spot. If for some reason you reverse them and you put the negative and the positive backwards, the speaker will actually draw inward instead of outward. That's the easiest way of telling whether you have the positive or the negative wire. And then the smart thing would be to tape off or to mark your positive and negative so you know which side it is next time. But again, simply touching the battery to both sides will not damage your speaker and it will cause the speaker to push in or out. Okay, the first thing I want to do, let's go over a couple quick things with the voltmeter. Uh, if you have not used the voltmeter before, the digital one is much easier for me. You can actually get a good quick reading. Um, you can see I've already tapped into a couple things on the bike here. I'll go over later with you. Um, basically, if I go into this hotline here, touch the ground, you'll see the number is a one. I've got it on 200 millivolts. If I flip it around and put the negative lead on the hot lead, it actually comes up and says minus one. That's how you know whether you're positive or negative. So in other words, I would know right now that my wires are backwards and not the right way around if I was going to be wiring something into this. Okay, underneath my seat, I've determined which two leads coming back from the radio are my speaker wires. I don't know which side's hot or ground. Don't know which one's positive or negative. Um, gonna do the same thing I did on the battery. Basically, I'm gonna insert the voltmeter here and here without touching them together. In this case, I've got a negative number. So I know, in fact, this right-hand lead is my positive side. I can tell by flipping the voltmeter around, I put the negative in the opposite side touch the positive down, and now I get a positive number. Now I know which side is my positive, which side is my negative, and I'm not forcing my speaker to fire in the wrong direction.